Let's uh, discuss question number one for section A. Right, this is compulsory question. The price index of a mobile phone in the year 2020 based on the year 2018 is 110. While the price index of the phone 2018 based on the year 2016 is 148.5. Find the price of the mobile phone in the year 2020 if the price for the mobile phone in the year 2016 is 200. First of all, this is the price index. Okay, for mobile phone 2020 based on 2018. So we can write we can write a price 2020 based on price 2018 times 100 is equal to 110 okay q is a price you can use a p if you want uh, normally q is represent quantity but we can use a price to represent the price for the phone so this is number one and then for the price for the other year compared to 2018 compare compare means we divide 2018 based on 20 price for 2016 times 100 is 148.5 right in order to find the price for the phone in the year 2020 we need the price index first so let's find the price index for the year 2020 based on the year 16 so what you need to do is you have to work out a ratio 2020 based on uh, 2016 okay so we can observe that this 2016 okay can be obtained from here so let's work it out so I will take P I will write here okay I write here I'm going to show you here let's say I take we have the price for 2018 or the price for 2016 times 100 is 148.5 right just now this is number one and we also got another information price for 2020 over price for 2018 times 100 is 110 right so based on these two we will work out the ratio for price for 2020 based on price for 2016 times 100 we want the ratio okay so if we want this ratio we will focus to 1 and 2 we will multiply right we multiply the 2 that means we will take P uh, this one we can bring over to be divided bring over to be divided it means we take P2018 or P2016 alright times with a P2020 over P2018 we multiply so in fact this one this 100 we can shift over it become over 100 shift over it become over 100 so we we'll take 148 0.5 divided by 100 times with the 110 divided by 100 so we will get this ratio alright so we we actually can simplify but because we want the index number so we have to times with the 100 here so here we have to times with the 100 so that we can get I2020 based on 2016 so finally, we will, we will work out the I 2020 based on 2016 and is equivalent to 148.5 times 110 over 100. So I just want to show you why there is over 100. That it should be the right way. So hence we can find this. Uh, we can find this. If you will get a, a number which is the price index for 2020 based on 2016 so 148.5 times 100 is 
times with the 110 divided by 100, right? So we we'll get 163.35. This is the I for the phone 2020 based on 2016. Then with this, we can find the price. So the price for the 2020 is unknown. So we will take X over price for the year 2016 given, right? This was given 200. So we will divide by 200. Divide by 200 and then we times with the 100 equal to the index number for the phone for the year 2020 based on 2016. So we will solve 200 times 163.35 over 100. So let's work it out. So it's just uh, take the answer times 2, right? Because we can cancel out the 100. So that means the price for the phone in the year 2016 is RM326.70. This is the answer for the phone in the year 2016. So that's all my sharing about how to find the price for the phone in the year 2016. Till then, bye bye and have a nice day. So this is actually the marking scheme for the price index. So you have to find the price index for the year 2018 based on 2016 and 2020 based on 2018 and then you multiply the two you will get a price index for the year 2020 based on the year 2016 and then we you will have to use this to find the price for the handphone in the year 20 uh, 2020 all right so the price index price index times with the price 200 over 100 so the price is 326.70